I did not change any of my settings I was supposed to. Fuck. I have to pay like what, 5, 000, not 5,500? I know it's not that bad. Ah! <laughs> I would just like to say everyone thank Wilbur for finally putting Screensaver on Spotify. after your Wi-Fi. Oh no, things are going to go wrong. It's back. Chill. We back. I didn't realize it was down for that long. Oh, no. Well, this is gonna be an unstable stream. I'm keeping that up because I do need it. Stream's gonna go down in fucking hell. Can people just put things into one part and not like space them out a million goddamn times? Sorry. Streaming ping. People wonder why I'm not active on certain discords. Can I please? Thank you. Not, why is this going so long? It's an hour version of Attack of the Killer Queen. Nice. Religion, can you kindly shut up, please? I do not miss is that goddamn bell. Hello, welcome back to Genshin Impact, you know, where I decided to spite everyone. 
Everyone is working super hard. We should be too. I'm going. I, uh, yeah, if you're curious, I didn't realize how much it was after Child's, after Unify Child. Um, so instead of me thinking, hey, I'm gonna be good, I spent the next 30 minutes on here after I was done streaming. I did not expect that to happen. Let me actually turn off Attack of the Killer Queen. <laughs> I- I did not expect to, uh, to be sitting here, uh, fighting a dragon with multiple people. Is there anything I can do for you two? I'm afraid that Wang Sheng funeral parlor isn't in the best but is state this, to receive guests. Is this where I get to meet? Is we this where I get to- see Zhang Li! Could you please tell him we're here? Unfortunately, Zhang Li isn't here at the moment. Hey, yo. It seems he went to Northland Bank. Oh, shit. Doesn't the Northland Bank belong to the Fatui? He technically Last is... Last time we saw Zhang Li was before we went to the Golden House. This is where we find out we have a, he has a contract. Do you think he doesn't know about the attack on Liu? Visiting the Fatui <gasps> There's a cat. At a time like this could only mean I'm more also drinking trouble. a Mountain Dew because our machine but downstairs is turned off. We had better go and off. make sure that everything is okay. Okay, let's go. Also, if you can't hear the game, please tell me I turned it down. Um, but again, I have settings turned differently. So I don't know how everything sounds. I see all these people with a bunch of things. Sorry, person. I have TikTok audio stuck in my head because I was listening to them. Also, I- we will see if I stream tomorrow because I start classes, so I might be dead inside, god damn it. I hate that so much, my mic moved. You call this cooperation between harbingers. <gasps> cooperation involves communication, oh, you know. Sure. <laughs> Don't take it to heart, child. Oh, shit. Besides, oh, aren't shit. you happy that you got to skip the formalities and bring chaos to the land? I'm sure you must have enjoyed chaos that. Chaos to the land? The thing didn't do oh, anything! It seems that some of your friends have arrived. We ain't friends. Hey, it's Zhang Li and Child! And. <laughs> it's you two. I believe we've met once before. In the city of Bards, was it? I'm glad you still remember my name. Listen! Ah, right. I imagine that it must have been rather hard to forget watching helplessly as something precious was snatched away from your friend. I can't wait well, to, to, uh... Well, it isn't you two. Oh, fuck this you. This is our first time seeing each other since Liyue was nearly wiped off the map. Are you sure about that? This is certainly a bit... awkward, wouldn't you say? Hmm. Paimon knew that we should never have trusted a Fatui Harbinger. Yeah, that's understandable. Oh, now don't say that. Sure, I may have misled you, but I never had anything against you personally. Besides, I thought we were getting along quite well together, didn't you? Except for that little tussle we had at the end. <laughs> Nothing personal. We just have different views, that's Listen. all. Of listen, course, you may listen. very well hold this against me. If I didn't know his story, I would hate you. it more, but I looked more of the it The real deceivers here are Senora and Zhang Li. Curse them for leading me on. So actually, I think... Stop wasting time, child. Hey, yeah. so shut the There'll fuck up. I want to hear this. What? Chat once I'm through here. Hey, yo. You remember the agreement, Morax. Now, if you would be so kind. Ow. Then no what in the world are you talking about? We... he had a contract, didn't he? The contract is fulfilled. Yep. That which thou seeketh is now bestowed unto thee. For my promise is solid as stone. This is why Amber is the best. Do not... what the fuck? What the fuck? <sighs> How sanctimonious. I mean, I did have my suspicions. What? So you're the Lord of Chia? No, wait, that's an exciting twist and all, but why give the Gnosis to the Fatui? 
I do not give it for free. I give it as agreed upon in the contract. For it is a matter solely between the Tsaritsa and I. Yeah, you don't at, think you at this point, I just want to know why. With that whole fake death thing? Everyone was preparing the ceremony for you and splat! <laughs> this big dragon falls what? out of the sky! Listen, I have a love-hate relationship with Paimon, but this is one of those moments I fucking love her. Disaster. <laughs> Gathering all the forces that had been bubbling behind the scenes, and then stirring them together in a pot that was bound to boil. Put me on over. a ship, and I'm stabbing her That's myself. That's what he wanted to see. Am I right? Wait, what? Perhaps it's best that I explain. As you know, I've dwelt upon this world for more than six thousand years. It is now three thousand seven hundred years ago that I founded Liu together with the Adepti. Even boulders that can withstand whirlpools will erode with the passing of time. So in other words, do not trust anyone from this goddamn place except for that cracks a had not begun to form, and that the end of my time had not yet come. Until one drizzly day, I as I was strolling along the harbor, I heard a merchant tell one of his workers. Also, I feel like the you finished I feel like your the duties. piece that's in Yargot for Venti isn't it real. Day. I don't know why. I just I have my suspicions. I stood motionless among the crowds, I feel like Venti is too goddamn smart myself, for that shit. Have I already finished my duties? He, he's a tone-deaf bard, Who but I feel like he's not me? that stupid. But as I began to consider relinquishing my divine role, I soon discovered that many reasons still remained to not hastily depart. Was Liyue, the city I had dwelt in for so long, already prepared to enter its next age? Oh, God. I decided that a test was needed in order to reveal the answer. So I feigned my own death and gathered the cast of Child, the Adepti, Excuse me. and the Liu Achising. That's right. Which is why I continued to safeguard the Gnosis until now. So you're telling me. So you mean that if the chaos ever reached the point of no return, you would simply appear and use your divine powers to bring Liu back under control? Of course, and it would have been all too easy for him, too. Just as a child quickly matures after losing their parents, so has Liu matured when faced with the death of its oh deity. My God. In the end, the resolution to all that has transpired was even more satisfactory than I could have hoped for. Oh, shut the fuck up. Take the Adepti, for instance. Owing to their years of seclusion, they were the least informed. Yet when faced with a crisis, they commendably showed the greatest amount of restraint possible. Not only did they manage to cooperate with the Qixing, but in the end, they even made efforts to understand the hearts of the people. Credit is also due to Signora, the emissary dispatched by the Cryo Archon to fulfill our contract. Ayo? At my request, she kept everything she knew in strict confidence. Also, this, I'm gonna say this. I feel like again, I know we're probably gonna have to fight her. Child. Um, this meant I could remain again, I know what happens to her. even having the chance to fulfill the age-old traditions of Liu in this mortal form. Thank you for joining me on this journey. <laughs> All of these things turned out as I had planned. There is only one thing that it's I had not anticipated, least, fucking next, and that was scream. the conduct of the Liu Qixing. I had expected them to do no more than the Adepti, to come to the defense of Liu. But when all was said and done, they seized the opportunity Poor to problem, supplant man. Liu as He's divine protector and used the subsequent power vacuum left by my death to quickly gain complete control of Liu. Huh? That doesn't sound good at all. <laughs> On the contrary, I think it is excellent. I had always feared that it was too soon for them to take over from me. And it was also that which I longed for the most. As such, I have nothing this to is say. the best parting gift anyone could have given this god of old. I wanna fucking hey, hit him! What about me? Doesn't anyone feel the least bit of remorse for deceiving me? Bitch! You've practically kept me in the dark! And you killed me! <laughs> I think that thanks would be more appropriate. You certainly played no small part in all of this. Bitch, wreaking havoc and turning the city upside down. The Lord of Geo ought to thank you for your performance, if anything. 
If you hadn't created the pressure of a battle between mortals, a Depti, and a god, the lump of coal resting in the hands of the Geoarchon, Liyur would never have been able to become a dazzling diamond of a city. Huh? Just whose side are you on, mocking me like that? Are you itching for a fight? Really hey, haven't you learned the Liyu is saying, don't always call it as you see it? <laughs> yeah, well then, you have with the Gnosis in my possession, I have no use for such idle chatter. We should return to Zapoljarni Palace and seek an audience with Her Majesty, the Tsaritsa. Come, child. Ah, fine. I'll meet you there later. I'm not sharing a boat with the ah. likes of you. Hmm. Do as you wish. And then there's uh, there's another story quest I have saved uh, in the back that I can do. Again, why is the traveler so tight? Now then, is there anything else you wish to ask me? Ah, what the fuck right. do they offer you? As Zhang Li always told us, a good trade is a fair trade. Paimon has no idea what could be a good trade for a Gnosis. Realistically speaking, there is no such thing. Huh? Oh, God. However, I am the god of contracts. For thousands of years, I have made countless contracts. If the deal was of no benefit, then I certainly it, it would not be inclined to, to agree to it. My agreement with the Cryo Archon will be the last of my contracts as the Geo Archon. My contract to end all contracts. As for the bargaining chip that the Tsaritsa used to balance the scales, uncover that answer for yourself in your future journeys. I'm now tempted to fucking Google it. You son of a bitch. You son of a bitch. Fuck him. Fuck him. I want to strangle him. What the fuck did that say? Today's the day of the right of parting. Although the star of the show is fake, we spend so much time trying to organize it, it would be a real shame not to go there now. I'm guessing this is the last- oh my god, my frames per second. I didn't even realize they were so high. Oh my god! You did not just see me get stuck in a tree. Worthless. Down we go. Oh, well, since we're going through with this rite of parting, I guess it means that those rumors hit the nail on the head. Uh-oh. So Rex Lapis is really... But they didn't catch the culprit, did they? Can we just oh, kill come him? on. Can Do you think that the assassin could have been a normal person? You know what I think. I don't think any of the gossip on the streets you hear from those shady types is worth anything. There's only one real possibility in my mind. I've heard that the assassin was that Fatui fellow. Youngish, oh, no. pretty high in rank. I think they called him child. Oh, no, child. <laughs> Man's not going to be allowed Fatui. back. Fatui? Hmm. They certainly are very suspicious. He's not going to be allowed back here. Who knows what those greedy, crooked folks... Shh! Lower your voice. If the Fatui catch you in their sights, Rex Lapis won't be around to protect you this time. And he won't be. Okay. You know that god from the ocean couldn't have just shown up out of nowhere. I mean, it's been 2,000 years since Rex Lapis subdued it. Yeah. Yes, and to think that this happened right on the heels of the incident I'm also with pretty Rex sure, Lapis, too. Uh, Say, yeah, no, I was in a Discord do you call think the with person them. who assassinated our Lord and released that evil I god was might Discord have been one of the same. Be child with, uh, now that you mention it, that's very as possible. You're, like, getting ready to watch you yes, it. it's very possible um, and there was indeed. One scene. Nyx knows what scene I'm talking about where I just I mean, it all fits thrilled. together. That person must have colluded with the evil god to harm Rex Lapis. Oh, that wicked, black-hearted scoundrel. Still, what sort of supernatural prowess must this person possess to be able to do such things? I have never heard of such a person in all my years. Ah, forget it. Guessing's no use to us. Look, 
The Millilith over there looks like he's about to make an announcement. Let's hear what the Ministry of Civil Affairs has to say first. Ah, shit. They're gonna say something. Alright. I accidentally knocked my mic. Ah, <laughs> oh, fuck, I want the flower. Hear ye all! The Chi Sing's words. Though a dragon soars ageless as the mountains, it too must return to dust. This is common knowledge. Gods and Adepti live glorious lives, but both light and shadow have their season. Ow, that so hurt. too must they face divinely appointed trials. Rumors Ew. and hearsay abound on the streets that Rex Lapis was murdered. Now, let the truth be revealed. Oh boy, here we Having go. Having been thwarted in his trial, Rex Lapis's soul has recouped the celestial heights. He beseeches the people of Lyra to grieve not and to let not, not their hearts be saddened. Ever try to say that on Nor screen. are they to believe street-born rumors or indulge in baseless speculation. Translation on what the Chi Sing's announcement said. <sighs> so that's how they're spinning it. Yes. Something feels off. Why would they suddenly give up looking for the murderer? Not to mention how this excuse sounds like something they just made up on the spot. Could the Chi Sing already have wrong. known that Rex Lapis wasn't dead? But Zhang Li said that neither they nor the Adepti knew anything. Wait, the Adepti don't know? Did Zhang Li tell them in secret after his gnosis changed? Exactly, right? It's possible. Ooh, seems like the rite of parting has been going on for a while now. Let's go have a look. Listen. Yeah. Look, it's Ningguang and Kuching. Are they saying something? Are their speeches over? I want... As said previously... I want all of them. Rex Lapis's soul returning to the heavens is the end of the contract. And it is also the end of an era. 3,700 years of contracts burnt and reduced to ash. Oh, also, I, I made the joke that we were gonna destroy the OJ Chamber. Yeah. We, I wasn't the people we of Liyue, were great. indeed prosperous. But blinded by our prosperity, we forgot that time can be pitiless. The long, unending dream of our Archon walking among us. Oh god, it's her. Mm. Now that we have awoken from our dream, we must learn I to trust, say farewell. I trust this one and this Will one you stand and with us really, as we reestablish our, our contracts? As we build a new age of prosperity. So concludes the words of Her Eminence the Tianquan. Does Her Eminence the Yuhang have anything to add? God, they're both fucking pretty. She's earrings! Huh? Is she looking this way? Oh god. Traveler. Hi. Yikes! She really is looking our way! <laughs> I feel like Paimon's not real! Is that the traveler who they say defeated the ancient god? <laughs> so young! The Liyue Qixing always repay their debts. And as you have heard, our eyes see far and our reach is long. Name your price. You deserve that much. Whoa! Paimon... Oh no! Oh no! I'm gonna ask her information about our brother. Well, could you help me put up some missing person posters? I I mean I knew it. I was close. Hi. Hello. Did not expect to hear the voice actress. For a second, I thought this said Material Girl. I was like, what the fuck? Okay. 
roping you in was possibly the most masterful move we could have made. <laughs> I believe. I don't even care if she's one of the future people generations I can't will say so too. I don't when care our if this deeds doesn't count. I love for her. Their review. It counted. We talking with all of them. The cleanup of the premises, managing the crowds as they exit, making an account of the right. There's much that remains to be done. I didn't miss anything, did I? <laughs> Why you? Were you just trying to look cool earlier, or are you really that selfless? Listen, yes. If you were looking for someone, you could have just told me that in private. Where is this bitch? I still want to hate you. Hey, Zhang Li! Fucking Paimon, man. Oh, awkward silence. Look at this. Everyone in Liyue is caught up in their emotions, thinking that they'll never see Poor Paimon again. <laughs> and here you are looking all relaxed. Listen, I want... <laughs> Why would I not feel more at ease? After laying down the burden I have borne for 3,700 years. Listen, I want to see, I just want to see a scene where right. he goes batshit. I just want to see the two snap. of you can spare the time, I should treat you to a meal at the Shinya kiosk. Oh, damn it. Ha! That sounds like big talk, Zhongli. Paimon might have believed you if you were treating us to some third round knockout. I was about to say, do you actually have the money to afford it this time? But you'd have to pay out your nose just to stand inside Shinya kiosk. Are you sure you can afford it? Hmm. Oh? You're right. <laughs> I do like the Mora. But why would... <laughs> As the Rex Lapis Morax, I can easily I create I fucking Mora. love that. It's like, why can't I? But since I have chosen to walk this earth as the mortal Zhongli, I should abide by the same rules that mortals do. When I was journeying with you, though I still had the Gnosis in hand, I knew that I must soon retire from my role as an Archon, so I had to rehearse a little gotcha. for my new life. Oh, no wonder! Paimon gets it now. You didn't look at the price tags when we were spending because you've never had to. But since you weren't used to not being able to just make more Mora as and when you wanted to, you had to try becoming a parasite to society who lives off of other people's credit. <sighs> well, we were only spending for Tui money. Bitch! You don't have to say it like that. I mean, true. In the city of commerce, it's good we thing do we not change. merely Actually, exchange money or goods. Money. We also exchange knowledge, memories, and foresight as well as positions, roles, and lives. The Archon Morax could never experience life as the true mortal Zhongli could, no matter how many times he descended to be with his people. Jesus. <laughs> I must thank you for that. I will treasure the memories that I made as Zhongli, traveling the streets of I New just hit my mic you. again. That is true. You think I would get a new mic? But I there wouldn't is no hit journey it as much, that but no, I still end. do. No meetings without partings. Hmm. Paimon thinks that we should make a move and continue our search for the Seven. I fear that continuing your journey may be difficult. The nation that neighbors Liyue by sea in Azuma is presently closed. Closed? Yes. The nation has been closed by oh, order shit. of its deity. The Electro Archon Ball. And just as the people another of Liyue preferred to call up. me Rex Lapis, she too goes by another name among locals in Inazuma. Raiden Shogun? Um, Paimon thinks we've heard that one before. Uh, Also Raiden? another person I would really let my bank That is die the for. case. And since Raiden is also the Shogun of Inazuma, people call her the Raiden Shogun. That said, though people at the wharf were saying that the situation in Inazuma is very I'm probably gonna have to level tense. up a little bit more, because I'm Paimon almost doesn't level remember 30. that always being the case. It wasn't that bad last year. Zhongli, since you're Rex Lapis, shouldn't you know something about what's happening there? Just how did Inazuma become a closed nation? It's because of visions. What? 
Visions? What? When faced with circumstances beyond their control, humans often bemoan their lack of power. But if a person shows true strength of will at a desperate and fateful moment in their life, the gods will look upon them with favor. This is what visions are. Magical foreshadowing bestowed upon those who have been acknowledged by the gods. Uh-huh. That's how people in Tevet see it. Oh, hello, ambulance. But starting from last year, the Raiden Shogun began promulgating the Vision Hunt Decree. Vision Hunt Decree? Yes. It was an order to seize all visions within Inazuma's borders and to inlay them upon the hands of the statue of the omnipresent god. They want to seize visions? But why? Aren't visions blessings from the gods? I know, I think I, I know I should think that in the Raiden Shogun's eyes, it is precisely because they are divine I think blessings I know why. that they should be under the sole dominion I'm, I'm of divinity. I'm pretty sure I know the reason why. Whoa, that's harsh. The Animo Archon is the god of freedom, and the Geo Archon is the god of contracts. For her part, the Raiden Shogun is the god of eternity. I want to know it what the rest of them are. It seems as though she has finally decided to eliminate any unstable elements that could pose a threat to her eternal realm. The fact that even I, the oldest of the seven, have now passed away, will only strengthen her resolve to pursue eternity. Knowing her, she must have again quoted that adage she is most fond of when proclaiming that decree to her people. Seven ideals for seven gods. And of these, Eternity is nearest unto the heavenly principles. Mm, again, I know the reason why, what happened to her. All right then. Was there anything else you wished to know? Yeah, about that. Before the chasing made their What is going to happen to him? We listened to a lot of people talking on the way. Most of them put the blame for everything on child. These are indeed false accusations. But it remains undeniably true that Child did send people to the Jade Chamber to prevent the Adepti and the Chi-Sing from defeating the ancient god. I've heard that Ningguang is busy milking that for all it's worth on the foreign relations front at the moment, browbeating the envoys of the Fatui. Ha! <laughs> Those poor Snezhnayan diplomats. If it were not for Child's exalted position as a harbinger, I'm certain that they would have shifted all the blame to him and called for his dismissal by now. Damn. All right then. Was there anything else you wish to know? Uh, <laughs> I'll do this and then I'll finish. Ah, that was a good one. Failing a divine trial. How they came up with that excuse, I will never know. That said, the reason why the Chi Sing were so eager to resolve the incident and stop pursuing the culprit was indeed because they received news in secret that Rex Lapis was not dead. I hinted as much to the Adepti as well. How did I accomplish that, you ask? Hmm. Uh, have you ever heard of this particularly convenient Adepti art known as gifting dreams and visions? Yeah, someone mentioned All it. All right then. Was there anything else you wished to know? There's nothing else. Well then. I suppose you'll have to find a way to get inside this closed nation. Have patience. I suspect it's because of the beloved. some serendipity must first come into play. It's because the beloved. <laughs> Fuck yeah. Oh, let's go. Hey yo, who's thing to have some luck? Who's Constellation? Alright, I'm guessing I need to be slightly higher level. Oh shit! Um, I'm gonna do this one first. But also, I, will sooner die. I have to very quickly use the bathroom. Um, because this is like my third drink of the day. Uh, so if some interesting shit happens, yell at me! Forgot about this chair is literally a fucking death trap.
in like a weird way. Okay. I want to finish this because it gives a lot of other magic things. My, why is my entire body in pain all of a sudden? Oh god, how far behind? Oh god, we are badly behind. Oh no, this is not fun. What happened? Oh, my bitray died. That's understandable. Then lay a hand on me. Yo? <gasps> this is not, I guess, a teapot? Okay, I'm gonna do this, and then we'll do the story, and then we'll do the teapot. Oh god, what the hell? Yo? Listen. Listen. Mommy? <laughs> Those memories. Who goes there? I forgot how traumatized this man is. Really? He didn't mention anything about a meeting. I really the master's don't. dealing with some urgent business today. All prior appointments have been canceled. Urgent business? I hate seeing what my bit rate it? that bad. Uh, the master's been working on a major business deal recently. He left early this morning to meet with a VIP client. So, where is he now? I'm sorry. The master is stressed that we must not disclose that information to just any- uh, No! I, I I mean, yes. Yes, you are. <laughs> I, I, I meant no offense. Please. I I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Master's <gasps> currently in business negotiations at Shinya Kiosk. I, I, I beg it. for your mercy, please. My master will show me no leniency if he finds out. Well, oh my, my master God, has much more important things to do than talking to rude guards like I didn't you. See that. I didn't look at the wind stairs. Luckily for you, your bad attitude will be the last thing on his mind when he's busy negotiating a big business lovely. deal with your boss. Thank you, thank you. May your business forever be blessed by the Lord of Geo. Nice work! Paimon never knew you were such a tough negotiator. It's called... I was, I was just bluffing, so? goddamn. Now Paimon knows not to let your wily ways get the better of her in the future. Anyway, seems like the VIP client in question must be one of the Fatui. I In that honest. case, let's get ourselves over to the Shinue kiosk. Am I even on the right path? See, this business is... Okay, yeah. Alright. But either way, if we want to know what kind of shady business they're up to, we better be careful. Sorry, something popped up. Children, come, come. <laughs> I just picked a glaze lily, like goddamn. Just the right moment. I've been looking for you. Oh, what is it, Granny? Need any help? I love how she calls her Granny. Oh, no, no. You've done so much for Leo Harbor already. I could hardly ask for more. In fact, my old friends and I have been putting our heads together to think of what sort of gift we might give you in return. A gift? For Paimon? You're too kind. Oh, child. You are so very modest. Uncommonly so, even. 
But you mustn't decline this gift. I simply won't allow it. Okay. When you traversed my old teapot in search of the cleansing bell, very I heard your little friend mention that you often camp out in the wilds. That simply won't do. Is that do. true? Do we actually Especially do that? Especially since I imagine you still have a very long journey ahead of you. Fortunately, I have not yet grown so old as to see my subspace creation abilities atrophy. Alright, uh, everything should be slightly fixed. Oh, did my uh, the bit rate went back up. That you? So you're gonna be. S I well, hit my mic again. You're gonna be slightly behind. Blessing we old folks but not like once a couple received seconds. from Rex Lapis. Part of our illumination, if you will. I will not go into too much detail, but subspace creation is the yeah, you're, ability you're a to couple create seconds. a small, autonomous pocket world. The teapot that you entered previously was a little trinket created using that ability. A trinket. So <gasps> is this the teapot? The is this where I'm going to cause all the chaos? It's just child's play, huh? Oh, indeed, the teapot is nothing to boast of. One such as myself must depart from this realm to create a world of one's own. Rex Lapis, on the other hand, moved mountains and seas. That is what one might call the an exercise song, like, of true in power. Uh, but that's enough nostalgia for now. The gift that I have prepared for you just requires a few final materials to add the finishing touch. That's right! Finding stuff's what we're good at, after all! We're doing just a bunch of side quests oh, right now, so... Settle down now, children. There's no need for you to go running hither and thither. I have already found a fleet-footed oh, youngster okay, to now I figured what out I this need. Work. Gotcha. What's more, I doubt that you would know how to find the materials I am searching for. Some of them are very rare really indeed these stop days. Talking. Well, for starters, I require some shimmer soil from the banks of Dihua Marsh. Back in the day, it could only be found where the glazed lilies thrived most profusely. You would have to dig downward, following the roots of the glazed lilies. And if you were lucky God, enough, you just might find a small patch of shimmer soil there. <sighs> but almost no one has been able to find shimmer soil in this manner since Dihua Marsh came to be the way it is today. Even more difficult to find is Smaragdus Jadeite, which must be chiseled from the rock of the chasm. Or so it used to be. Ever since the Blackcliff Forge opened for business, they've slowly but surely stripped the mines all but completely bare of it. In any Holy case, shit. Smaragdus Jadeite is an adept eye treasure. And the adeptal power within is not something that most humans can withstand. Extended contact with it is, in fact, harmful to humans. Well, I think we've come uh, to the conclusion the traveler's knows not that a human. that child will succeed in finding these items. Who's this child? Well, since you're an adeptus, Granny, the person you asked for help, they must be an adeptus too, right? Hmm. I mean, yes. we held we held the power of what four. She does count uh, as an adeptus. She counts. How come there are so many adepti in Leila Hall? Are we talking about Ganya? We seem to bump into them all the time. It feels like even when you go out to eat, you could be sitting next to an adeptus and never even know it. God damn it, <laughs> Maybe so. Who can say? A fair few of my old friends are rather fond of mundane mortal life, after all. I'm back, Granny. <gasps> oh, I don't believe we've met. Ah, allow me to do the honors. This child here is Yen Fei. She's the one helping run some errands for me. Yen Fei, I believe you've already heard of the traveler and her Hi, traveling companion. Hi, she's so companion. pretty! 
Of course, who hasn't? Much has been written about you in the Millilith's records. Oh, cool. You became one of Liyue's most wanted after the Millilith marked you as a suspect following the <laughs> incident at the Rite of Dissension. We became most wanted. <laughs> after which, you fought off the Millilith at Julian Karst and made contact with the Fatui. Before finally defeating an ancient god together with Granny and her associates, and subsequently being cleared of any and all suspicion by the Chising. <sighs> what a shame. What? A shame that we didn't meet sooner. Oh, I was like, a shame I didn't go to if jail? We had, well, I can't say that I would have been able to clear you of suspicion immediately, but it certainly would have been less, uh, embarrassing for you. Allow me to introduce myself once more. I'm Yenfei, a legal advisor. Got a legal problem? You can come right to me. Oh, yes. Here's my business card. Business You'll find card. it has my contact details just and business office card. address. Keep it handy. If you have an urgent issue, just leave me a note at this address. I also... Oh, and I almost forgot to mention. I offer a very generous discount for first-time customers. All right, Yenfei. Oh, I didn't never right. notice that. I never Let's noticed... Get to the business uh, I mean, I hand. could have noticed it earlier, but everyone has like, their own like, unique like, color dire scheme. need of legal assistance at the moment. You'll have to excuse Yanfei. She's always been like this. Ever the talkative one when it comes to her own affairs. Paimo was gonna ask the same question. You seem really different who's, who's from the ones we've actress? met before. An adeptus? Uh, I guess. Kinda. My old man said he was one anyway. Uh... He mentioned that he once campaigned with Rex Lapis for a long old time. And then after that was all over, he went back and married my mom. They had me, and once I was all grown up, the two of them upped and left on a journey, leaving me with Granny here. Sorry, I'm looking up who her voice actress is. I'm trying to see, like, oh, never mind. That's where I know her from. Is there anything else I know her from? Her name sounds very familiar to me. Oh! There it is. Cool. Well, that's a bit casual for an adeptus. Aren't you guys supposed to sign solemn contracts to protect Leo at Harbor and all that stuff? What do you mean he just went back to get married? Well, my dad did say that he'd talked it through with Rex Lapis and that anyway. I did not mean not to do that. On that too much. So, Granny, I've gotten a hold of most of the stuff you asked for, except for Smaragdus Jadeite. I couldn't find any at all. The so. chasm's been sealed off, and there's just no way in. Couldn't secure any documentation either. <sighs> Looks like the Ministry of Civil Affairs is serious about keeping it strictly locked down. Oh, time is to break that in. so? Hmm. But Smaragdus Jadeite is really rather essential. Yenfei, are you sure you can't find some other way? They have helped Liyue greatly, after all. It is only right that they are duly rewarded. I know, Granny, you've told me a thousand times I already. do want to mess with her a little bit now. Well, the chasm's definitely a no-go, but there's still a chance we can figure out some alternative means of procurement. Hmm. Hold on a moment. Let me have a look. There's probably going to be a day I'm just going to spend just Whoa, fucking around with characters. That's a really thick book. What kind of things do you write in there? Commercial consultancy. Or, or, Snezhnaya. Ah, found him. Krussel. A Snezhnayan merchant who once came to me with some legal queries on certain articles in the legal codices. If my memory serves, all of them had to do with rare ores. He mentioned this is that he was too considering smart for acquiring some Smaragdus Jadeite to make hairpins, and wanted to know if there were any legal ramifications that he should be aware of. Said he was planning to sell them in Snezhnaya. So, I guess I'll go look for him. With any luck, he'll have gotten his hands on some Smaragdus Jadeite. Crying. Brain or is might crying. have an idea of where we can find some. Oh, you. you wanna join me? I suppose that's no problem. But it's best if you just stand by and watch. If you try to get involved, you'll only risk placing yourself in legal jeopardy. Wow, an adeptus Fun. imploring us to avoid incurring legal liability. Well, that's oh, a first I... for sure. That's metal. Uh, best we be a little more careful than usual while we're with her. Damn, I didn't even mean to like start this one. I <laughs> we we straight up started the teacup one by accident instead of doing this one like we were supposed to. 
Hello? God? Okay. Okay, so yeah, they're rebuilding the uh, J Chamber, which if you actually, I... If you actually go to a certain place in here, you can actually see where it is. World Crest, World Crest, teleport, teleport. Welcome. I keep forgetting like some of the buttons I can really press. Uh, yeah, she's over here. Hmm. Oh yeah, I forgot she works with that. I actually really like the design of this. Profile. She's so cute. I love her. Yeah, she is adorable. I love her. Oh, her shoes are too- <gasps> Hey. The more I look at her, the more I love her design. I might fuck around with her and find out. Huh. Where are we going? We going up there. <laughs> Recruitment. Oh, wait. Okay, that's cool. They actually did it. Nice. God, this this makes me feel like I'm back in Chinatown. Like, I know that's the whole point, but like, damn. No! Hey, friend. I understand. I do. Please, do not worry. You have my word that the oh, order shit. will be completed Please, so as fight promised. Him. Hmm. The subordinate I sent was not quite so optimistic in his appraisal. Is somebody being uncooperative? Uh, we just ran into a minor procurement problem. I know that voice. We haven't managed to purchase the core lapis yet. But oh, it's voice. nothing for you to worry about. If Chang the Ninth won't sell, I can buy from someone else. I'm trying to think, like, who are, like, NPC That would voices. be most ideal. I remind you again that the Fatui care only about the result. It's so unimportant. We are willing to lend a certain degree of support to this transaction. It's not, it's not, who, it's but not who's, like, if it is not completed in time, they could do that voice. you may suddenly find our goodwill comes at a price you cannot afford. I understand. I am indebted to you for your protection. You know I would not dream of disappointing you, don't you? We shall see when the time comes. <laughs> Darn that old man, Chang. Ignore that. So, Mr. Chentry Milk, I haven't switched on my phone. I forgot I had my uh, stream pulled up. Or my, like, Who knows if Gula Geek has made any progress? Should we go tell him? And with that, the I was like, what the hell is that sound? I'm hearing voices. Okay, let's make my life easier! I've been playing with so much Minecraft recently, I literally just double clicked my W to sprint. Knowing that's not the correct uh, button. Huh. Hey, friend. You had other things to look into, as if you're some sort of man of mystery. <laughs> when Hi, actually, Ren. all you meant was you wanted somewhere new to park your backside while you read your book. Goddamn. I see. I guessed as much. 
Did you really guess, or are you just saying that to sound clever? The course of action we must take is now clear. To start with, please deliver this letter to the Feiyun Commerce Guild. They will know what to do. My liege, for reasons that I cannot explain, I will be unable to join you. There is no need for you to read the contents of the letter. When the time comes... Ugh, this writing is super hard to read. Paimon kept... Uh... Hence why I said there's no need for you to read it. It's Bennett's... The Feiyun Commerce uh, Guild will have someone actress. who can understand it. Well, why would you want to get them involved? They're one of the big wig commerce guilds in Liyue. But the why one thing would I actually they like about this is that there's a lot, like, different, like, fe there's a lot of different voices for different people. Like, there's a bunch Since of females acting, Liyue, uh, females Paimon voicing, keeps hearing people uh, mention females. It. Seems there's a bunch of females voicing males that you really don't see a lot because they just cast here. themselves. Having such big backing would be great and all, but are you sure they'd want to help? Why did my no brain get like, about that? Uh, forget, From what I like, know, the they share my sense of chivalry. Who? Once they but have I'm read the carefully sure reasoned and passionately um, argued case I put forth in this letter, they will certainly be moved to action. I'm pretty sure it's. Is it Venti's? Yeah, I was like, I'm pretty sure it's Venti's voice actress who is... Gentry Mautsai must be taught a lesson he will never forget. This is something we cannot is, do uh, on our own. Who's uh, on also, and Persona 5. I do not wish for anyone else to know of my involvement There's in this. There's a bunch of people's voices who Why I not? cannot catch You're off You're only doing this to try and help chain the ninth, right? To silently disappear at the matter's conclusion, concealing one's name and contribution. This is the chivalrous thing to do. To savor the memory is ample reward. Each droplet of kindness I receive, I am duty-bound to repay with a welling spring of gratitude. I seek neither praise nor reward. That sounds very lovely. But be honest, you just want them to do it so you can carry on reading your book, don't you? Thank you in advance for delivering this letter to the Feiyun Commerce Guild. Someone from the Guild should be able to receive you near Lioli Pavilion. Cool. Hey! Stop ignoring Paimon! <laughs> That's what you get for. Has completed a letter. Okay. Uh, come for a storm. Bruce, my beloveds. I love running across Bruce. Hey, friend. Excuse us. We come bearing news of a matter requiring your- A letter? Oh, I see. This again. You know something? No, oh, don't mind me. I was just speculating. Let me give this a read. Can we actually read this thing? Is it even is that written in the common tongue? Hmm. Is that what yes, the script is inimitable by the uninitiated. Yep. Wait. Honored guests, you must both be wary from your long journey. Please allow the Feiyun Commerce Guild to be your host for tonight. Wait, what? Please rest assured that the matter written about has been duly received. That sounds like We just Koi need some time to prepare. Alejandro. Please I take a seat here one. in Leo Lee Pavilion. I hate how I sound like I know the voice actor, but I just like... In the ocean view. Consider it a small token of our esteem. No, Yay, that also could tasty be... snacks! They're giving us the VIP treatment! That also could be... Of course. Griffin. We treat visitors with the utmost yeah, no. respect here at the Feiyun Commerce That's Guild. Griffin. When honored guests grace us with their presence, far be it from us to shirk our duty you to know, them. You know, I just, I just, like, Please, my brain likes this to way. put, like, voice actors together. I don't know why, it just does. So a lot of times I'll say a character's voice actor. Like, I know them. <laughs> I'm the best rally competitor ever. When I don't mean to. I'm just like, I... And Paimon thought we'd get kicked out, or turned away at the I door. I don't know why, I just like to. It's weird. I'm sorry. Paimon didn't think Guhua Geek had so much clout. Hello? Thank you for your patience. Yeah, it's Griffin. With the amount of wealth and power Gentry Mautsai has, it will take more than a slap on the wrist to get through to him. For him to correct the error of his ways, he must feel for himself the same suffering he has inflicted on Chang the Ninth. Since Gentry Mautsai's business has to do with Core Lapis, we simply need to buy up all the stock there is in Liu. 
That will put him in a rather sticky situation. Deprived of the necessary raw materials, even the best craftsperson in Tevat would be unable to make their I product. I just like knowing like what. Great idea! What voice actors That'll be do sure what. to mess things up between him and the Fatui. But Lyra is huge. Is it really We're possible to buy up every last bit of core lapis in the harbor? With the time scale we are on, it is indeed a challenge. Hence, as stated in the letter, we must ask for your further cooperation in the matter. First, there are a number of vendors in the city you will need to buy from. I've marked their respective locations oh, on your Jesus. map. There is also some unsold core lapis at the chasm. You will need to purchase that too. Finally, there is Chang the Ninth's batch. Alrighty, so three sellers in the city, another one at the chasm, and then Chang the Ninth. Right Does this actually out. unlock the chasm? Of course. We are not expecting you to cover the costs. Thank God. Wow, so many Mora! With cash like this, Paimon could rent out Leoli Pavilion and eat there for a whole month! <laughs> well, this is not the first time we've had to do something like this. It's just par for the course now. All you need to do is strike a deal. The Feyun Commerce Guild will handle the transportation and other trifling matters. Once you have purchased all the core lapis, Please proceed to the Feyun Commerce Guild's warehouse, oh God, where you can see the rest of the plan unfold. Gotta hand it to Guhua Geek. This is some seriously solid work for a guy who lives in a fantasy world. Let's do this in the order the guy said. First the sellers in the city, then the cast. Uh, yeah. let's go do the people in the city, and then we'll do, um, everything. that's a person that just spawned in front of me. Hi, anything I can do for you? Why does she look like the one person that uh, Shaoling fought? You want all my core lapis? Uh, I've already agreed to several orders. That said, none are in writing. The buyers are being incredibly indecisive. Oh, it's for the Feiyun Commerce Guild? <laughs> hmm, seems sure, just mention a guild. That works in everything. Oh, uh, <laughs> nothing. Just talking to myself. Come, let us sign a contract. Don't worry about my prior client. He hadn't made any down payments or anything. Quite common in the industry. Thank you for your patronage. We hope the Feiyun Commerce Guild will continue to do business why with us. Why the fuck does it feel like I'm, like, buying a house? I right, go to the store. Uh, what are the here? Cat. You look like Great Kitty. Those stripes. I also know I do need to level up my uh my entire. Let's see some action. Fuck! I should not have made that. Oh, not this dick. Oi! Shh! Keep your voice down. Why? All of it? Though my business may not seem so big, I should warn you that I can get what you need, both legitimately and not so legitimately. <laughs> Please tell me I don't actually have to barter. Best you give me an actual number. Listen, I can barter All of it would be far more than you actually want. Fe a Feyun Commerce Guild? I was like, listen, well, I cannot didn't barter in real life, so? but put me in D&D? If it's Ooh, for shit, the I can Feyun barter my Commerce life. Guild, then sign on the dotted line, and I'll start getting things in order right away. Oh, shit. Okay, that was easy. Hey! I was like, I see. I see shiny shit. Alright, the question is. Right. I was like, how the fuck do I get down? It's like, how the fuck do I get out of here? I don't know what happened, Chief. I literally just wanted to look in the boat and. Hello? Okay. Let's 
straight ahead of me. Good day, my friend. My apologies, but I'm out of stock at the moment. Please try again next time. Is that Chris? Oh, I thought you were here to purchase Snezhnaya products. No, that I still have. Although I ship it all to factories in Snezhnaya. I don't do retail. Too much hassle, not enough return. Sorry. Doesn't, we'll take it off. What? Uh, no, 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 no. Give me a second to think. Um... Uh, all right, I'll do it. Just need you to sign for it. Clearly, no shortage of cash flow in the air. Isn't that going to work tonight? Is that going to work tonight? Quick look uh, if, if Air Zach is going uh, live tonight. Because if he is, uh, haha. <laughs> Place Genshin Impact. Does he? I was like, I know he has one that's up and coming and he streamed three days ago. Um, but I don't think, I don't think he's going today. I think he's, I think he's streaming on the 19th. I think he's streaming Wednesday. The fact that we actually have to think about that. Uh, what is my closest way to get to the... Teleport. Oh, yeah. Eek. Oh god, what the hell happened to my... Oh god. Oh, you don't see me. You absolutely do not see me. No, I, I, uh, earlier I was fighting, uh, I was fighting a creature and as I was walking to it, I ran into mobs and I was like, you do not see me. Oh, usually when that means, nope, everything else is good. Let's make sure my bit rate is not failing me. Because I do not want the stream to go down. <laughs> this just feels creepy as hell. Now I want to know, will this actually unlock the chasm? The long face. Because you're alive, aren't you? Hello there. Are you in charge of the core lab? Bitch, I'm here? barely alive. Aha! Finally, I thought you might come. I hear the Feyun Commerce Guild has been buying up all the core lapis stock in Liu Harbor. As it happens, I do have a batch of core lapis that hasn't been shipped yet. It's all yours Thank if you. you name the right price. Oh God damn it! How much does it cost? The original buyer's price was already quite high, so... Hmm. The best I can do is... Seven million mora. Fuck! Are you serious? We spent less than a hundred thousand mora on the rest of Liyue's stock put together! I'm afraid it has to go million? to the highest bidder. I'm breaching an existing agreement by selling to you, so... It has to be worth my while. <sighs> uh, look, you have your problems to deal with and I have mine. You could take it or leave it. So Are if you're you? not buying, please leave me alone. All right, all right. We'll pay, even if it is a ridiculous <sighs> price. We're paying, we're paying. When we get back, we'll just have to tell the guild that we'll sell to this gentleman at four times the normal price in the future. <laughs> Wait, <laughs> surely there's no need for that. Please, don't do this. It's not even your money. Why be so frugal with it? Maybe because the last time it I spent all my money, I was told I'd keep the rest. We'll have a tough time explaining to our boss why we spent so much in one go. If he asks, all we can do is mention your name and say you gouged us over the price. I... I understand. I'm sorry, please. I don't want any trouble with the guild. There's just one other thing, though. 
There's been an issue with the delivery of this batch. Here, uh, we are not something were ambushed by man hilly churls. I don't know where exactly, but if I can't retrieve the goods, then I can't sell them to you either. So maybe you could go and look for the carts? There should be five of them in total. If you can find them all and tell me where they are, I'll sign the contract right away. Oh, there it goes. We have to. Oh, thank you very much. This is a lot to ask, I know. Listen, I'm not that much. That's rich. that then. Well, no time. All right. And then there's uh, search the carts. Okay. That was a white iron piece. Hey, yo, the fuck. <laughs> oh, God, what the hell? Oh, fuck. And I'm on fire. Thyself. 
No, please be distracted by the bird. I forgot he like he really like, does not give a shit about that. He is almost dead. Stop. That was not worth it. The troop appreciates any donation. Actually, that was kind of worth it. Okay. That was uh, kind of okay. Oh my god, we were so behind. Alright, hold on. We're seeing if refreshing works. No, we're still... We're a little bit behind with the refresh. Yeah, we're still behind, but it's like, it's better than what it was. It's better than it being, uh, terrible, terrible, terrible. Yeah, we're fine. We're fine. We're totally fine. We're not fine. Welcome to college Wi-Fi where everything sucks. Okay. Hot mode, I didn't care. Let Paimon see. Cause like if you're telling me I got that on the first try, uh I'm amazing. There's some over here. Oh yeah! Make a note of the location. We'll set Okay. That's two. Again, this area is large and fucking surrounded. Yeah, continue down this way. Please don't notice me. Who's on the cart? Not doing that. Okay, so I got three. I love doing that. It's so funny just like slide. Ah. Okay. Another. All right. Cool. So there's some air slimes over there. No, because I would go out of bounds for this one. I'm gonna check this one. I don't think we checked over here. Which it doesn't even look like there's a cart. It doesn't like hurt the check because there's some mint. Um, no cart. No cart. But I do see the hilly. There it is. Get out of my way! You I already. Oh, yeah. Okay. Shut it! Her shield is. or her shield is a lot. Hey, I got him too. Okay. Let's dance. I'm just gonna bully him with armor really quickly. Because Barbara's a healer and I love her. 
Pretty impressive healing. Here, we've made a note of the cart's locations, all five of them. Can you sell us the core lapis now? Oh, wonderful. Thank you both. Yes, let's make this official. I also hope uh, you could put in a good word with your boss. Oh my for god. Me. Done and dusted. Yeah! Paimon's got a knack for this business, Oh, malarkey. God, it's windy outside. Don't I really don't like dealing with wind. Now for the final button. stop on our core lapis crawl. To chain the knife. Nope, but place. I can figure it out. Also, one of my teachers literally said to dress like Zoom appropriate. And I was like, what the fuck is Zoom appropriate? Oh, I, f I keep forgetting like all the places I have Demons things. do not stop for the raid. Move. I'm moving, you dick. Many hey. mortals fear lightning. Incomprehensible. Fear of something so common. I actually love lightning. I love lightning storms. <laughs> if he would have gotten hit, I would have fucking laughed. You're probably wondering, like, why I switched Lisa out. Honest, honestly, I did it just because. Just who I was hoping to see. I want someone who has I aim, just even though it's not like, myself. even though it's not pyro. Gentry mud size uh, thugs have been mysteriously lot. absent for a while now. You wouldn't know anything about that, would you? I was not paying attention. Oh, don't worry. You won't be hearing from them again. Oh. What, what happened? Huh? Oh, oh, I see now. You're, you're in this trade too. Oh, so you're no. trying to beat him to the post, eh? No, Appearances can be deceiving, him. that's for sure. No, I but just... I don't care who you are. A discount of 70% is simply impossible. The, the maximum I can do is 40% off. And even then, I'm, I'm only breaking even. I don't want a discount. No need. We'll take it at the market rate. Y you mean you're not trying to force the price down? Wh what's, what's going on? Have I died and gone to heaven? I can't believe it. I will make a profit on this batch after all. But gentry mount-sized thugs could still come back after I've sold it. If Paimon told you they're not gonna bother you again, then you'd better believe- Huh. Okay, then. How, how can My situation can hardly get worse all. from here in any case. But tell me, what on earth do you plan to do with so much core lapis? Actually, it's for a commission. Can't go into too much detail. Thank you. I'm not going to tell Thank them about it. Thank you a million seems. times over. I really don't know what to say. Good people always get what's coming to them in the end. And so will the Ow. nasty people. Anyway, let's get going, because apparently we have a show to watch at the Feiyun Commerce Guild's warehouse. I have the hiccups. And like 50% of the time, my hiccups are painful. Uh, and this just so happens to be one of those hiccups. So I'm probably gonna be in a lot of pain. Also, I love her design. Don't 
This is probably not gonna hurt her. Hey, friend. Welcome. The final act in this drama would not be complete without you two here as audience. I still can't get over just you not better seeing believe fucking it. Bennett. We're the ones who've been doing all the work. What exactly have you been doing all this time? Uh, well, naturally, I use the time to immerse myself completely in Legend of the Shattered Halberd. That's expected. I managed to finish the book off, and I enjoyed every minute of it. Divine Halberd, an ominous sword. Mir and Wei Yang. He's a, he's a bookworm, the way the story so I don't hate him too much, but goddamn, you could have helped out a little bit. Nothing short of exemplary. But the sixth volume? Oh, words fail me. How blessed we are to have such an author grace our world with such works. And this is related to Gentry Meltsai, how? It's not. But when something surpasses expectations to such a degree, one must show one's appreciation. <laughs> You saw how everything would play out. And it is thanks to your help that everything will play out just as I had foreseen. Why does Paimon have to be the only one who doesn't get what's going on? No fair! Because you're a doofus, but we uh, love you. So go on then, tell me, what are we doing here? And what's this big dramatic showdown thing that's supposed to happen? Think about it. Gentry Mautzai goes searching for Core Lapis all over Liyue Harbor, and he doesn't find a single piece. He panics. Without the goods, he can't fulfill his contract. And if he can't fulfill his contract, he can't stay in good standing with the Fatui. Oh, he hears shit. a rumor that the Feyun Commerce Guild is the culprit. Panic turns to disbelief. This is smart. Jinshi Mautsai is a hugely powerful figure in the business world. Never has anyone dared to target him like this. So regardless of whether it is revenge or a swift resolution that he seeks, he is certain to... So it was you! Oh no! You were the ones sticking your necks out for Chang the Ninth! Speak of the devil. I went everywhere trying to find someone oh, selling no. core lapis before I realized we're gonna have the Feiyun Commerce Guild had been on an acquisition spree. Core lapis is hardly a rare mineral, and yet suddenly the stocks dry up, just like that. Explain yourselves. What is the meaning of this persecution? You're an asshole? We are not persecuting you, but protecting another, one to whom I am indebted. Upon witnessing an injustice, it is a perfectly normal response to rush to the aid of he who has been wrong. <laughs> Damn, Air what? I Was hate it him. not one of your own men who said, this isn't over? <clears throat> you clearly don't know what's good for you. I won't beat around the bush. Master, if you please. Seize their core lapis. What did I say? I said I was going to have to fight someone. Yeah, let's go. Outlines your fate. You're open, brother. Rain cutter. Time to act. Oh, let's go. Pay your dues. Oh, God. Body and mind. Shit. No, my sword. Oh, shit. Time to act. Okay, I got rid of his Body and mind. Prepare yourself. I was like, what the fuck did I do? <sighs> Impressive. <laughs> you are no commoners. <sighs> to continue this fight would be to incur greater losses than I can accept. Their strength is almost spent. Finish them off. The core lapis is almost Again, we could always just call, uh, call someone. Might I remind you that the Fatui's relationship with you extends to business matters only? I did not lend you my men to have them stir up trouble at your beck and call. Oh, oh, shit. oh, oh shit. What are you saying? Master, everything I did, I did with only one thing in mind. To complete the order. 
Then figure it out by yourself. Oh shit. <laughs> D don't go. Wait. Master, wait. My lord, what are you doing here? Are you hurt? Thanks to this valiant young woman, I am unscathed. My lord? You? You are the heir of the Feiyun. No, no. Shut Indeed, up. my liege. I am Xing Cho, disciple of the Guhua clan and second son of the Feiyun Commerce Guild manager, and I make no secret of it. Drats! I've been played like a fiddle. Gentry Mautzai. Coercion and intimidation what? are hardly the attributes of a respectable businessman. The problems that your business practices have created, I have sought to resolve through mine. I shudder to think what the Fatui will do with you if you fail to provide their core lapis. You meddling swine. Well, you go on. Swine. I love it. Tell me, what will you sell it for? Since you asked Chang the Ninth for a discount of 70%, let's fight fire with fire, shall we? Shit. Three times the market rate sounds fair, no? Fuck! How dare you subject me to such viciousness? This is a malicious and calculated attempt to run me into the ground. Deep breaths now. This is a simple decision. Will you buy or not? I... 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 <clears throat> Fine. Have it your way. Damn. I'll find the money somehow. Happy oh, now. God, that was, that was On behalf of the Feiyun Commerce Guild, I thank you for your business and hope you will continue to do business with us in future. I don't think any of you could see my face, but goddamn. Funny speaking, book reading, guhua geeking, Tsing Cho are the heir of the Feiyun Commerce Guild? I mean... So that massive stash of Mora you let us burn through in a day? That was from your private vault? Twas but a paltry sum. I got to make a very sound investment while putting Gentry Maltzai in his place. A classic two birds, one stone situation. Okay. <laughs> you are too kind. You have valor in your heart, and that is worthy of admiration. Yikes! Paimon's been calling you Guhua Geek this whole time! Paimon read in one of these martial artist novels that when rich heirs like you get angry at someone, you have their arms and legs chopped off. Why are you looking at us? Ah, Paimon's toast. And sorry, very sorry. Please don't hurt Paimon. Calm down. Since you can fly, you hardly need your legs anyway. Ah, save me, save me. This is not a drill. Repeat, this is not a drill. Jokes thinking. aside. I have the two of you to thank for this successful resolution. Really, you were a huge help. Meanwhile, Legend of the Shattered Halberd was positively riveting. Are you Much us... obliged if you could return it to Chang the Ninth for me. Are you making us run out of there? I did nothing, and hence deserve none of his gratitude. The two of you, meanwhile, though strangers to the circumstances, stepped in and saved the day. To have made such valiant and chivalrous friends is more Why? than enough Chaos. for me, my that's liege. That's understandable. My lord, uh, forgive the that's intrusion. A, that's such a wayward It's thing. about your father. Please inform my father thusly. I have averted a disaster and earned a sizable sum of money in the process. Might this meritorious act compensate for my prior transgressions and earn me a few more days of freedom, perchance? Legend of the Shattered Halberd speaks of a domain that I should very much like to investigate. For all your clever long words, the fact is you're just a lazy bones who doesn't want to work. <laughs> work. What if I told you that a reward awaits you at Cheng the Ninth's palace, and not just his gratitude? Hey yo. A reward? Hmm. Well, that's the deal. Paimon literally only cares someone. about money, and that's so funny. Uh, it seems whatever I say, there's no persuading you to stay. Oh, I didn't realize you weren't aware. Hey yo. Thank you in advance for returning the book for me. I will take my leave now. May we meet again, fellow merchants. Alright. Uh, do, 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 do. I meant to hit. Oh my god, I played this game for so long, yet sometimes I literally forget commands. Because I'm a dumbass. Someone's lying. The damned lying. will sooner die again than lay a hand on me. Oh, 
I was like, why with her can we see like her electro thing and I realized her vision's on her back. I was like, I know. Hey, yo. Yeah, I can level her up to 40. Um, I need to level up a bunch of people up. My. I know. I know I need to do good. Finally, Let's you're see. back. Streamer likes this to be morning, a the pawnbroker showed up and gave me back my entire collection. Hey. I'm positive that you must have been behind this once again. Thank you. Thank you from the bottom. Please don't say that. You have no idea how much this means to me. He got his collection of books back. The Chang family was a prestigious household oh, in Liyue go. back in the day. Unfortunately, the after I took over the family's affairs as heir, a series of business setbacks devoured our fortune. Since then, I've saved for years, hoping to restore the house to its the former wife, glory. Man. In the end... Everything was riding on this Corlapis deal. Were it not for you, this barren wasteland in the mountains would have become my final resting oh no. place. Wow, that's the second heir we've met in this town. <laughs> I'm sorry, what? Uh, oh nothing. Oh, here's your book back. Wonderful. Legend of the Shattered Halbert. I was beginning to think that Goofwa rascal had swindled me. Do people nice. really look down on the Guha clan so much? Actually, the art is centuries old and was once held in high esteem. But now it has faded beyond recognition. To instigate a revival, you need to inject some fresh blood, but uh. it's hard to attract budding young talent to a dying art. And so it becomes a vicious cycle. In any case, Guha kids these days. Take that young day. rascal Xingqiu, for instance. For all his talk about repaying kindness with kindness and whatnot, what has he done to show for it? You're the ones who've displayed a genuine sense of responsibility. Ah, uh, what does it matter? Anyway, <laughs> you wanted the Liyue volume of the Tevat Travel Guide, didn't you? I'll fetch it for you. Oh yeah, shit, I forgot about that It's book. yours to keep. In addition... Here is but a small token of appreciation for I your huge generosity. My ore is sold, and my treasured books have returned. I can't believe it. Uh, what? 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 <laughs> what was that? Paimon saw something fall out. What is... Oh, nothing, nothing. That little rascal surely isn't... Excuse me? Nice. Okay. Alright. We're almost level 30. Holy shit, that gave me 60. Okay, that's a world quest. It's not a story quest, but that's multiple parts. Uh, compared to like the rest of these. Let's go do this one. Hey, this is where the uh, Wind Rising event is. Pop! Nice, okay. That was fancy as hell. Uh, uh, did I... I did not do the thing. Navigate. There we go. <laughs> See, streamer is sometimes dumb. Streamer likes to do stupid things. Do I have enough for wish? Probably not. Oh shit, I do. I have seven. I have a week. I have a week to gamble my life away to try to get her. Oh, this is gonna do damage. Or not. 
I have gathered everyone here oh, today God. to make an important announcement. Perhaps some of you will have heard the news already. I am, in fact, planning to rebuild the Jade Chamber. Rebuild the Jade Chamber? That's a huge project! Why do I know that voice? So the rumors are true. No wonder the price of building materials has gone up so much lately. Oh no. The Jade Chamber means a lot to Lady Ningguang. Getting involved in this would be a huge opportunity. Oh god. Lady Ningguang, is there any way we can be of service? Patience. Since the news made it out a few days ago, I have already had many people contacting me to declare an interest in joining the project. Nevertheless, I do have a few matters I should like to entrust to you here today. <laughs> Main character moment. The building site has been chosen, and most of the materials have been assembled. Three key items are, however, still outstanding. They are as follows. Sunset Vermilionite, Wonder Cores, and Adepti Sigils. Don't I have one of those? Uh, excuse my ignorance, Lady Ningguang. I, I'm familiar enough with Plostrite, but I've never even heard of those other two. Only sufficiently large pieces of Plostrite, or specifically, Vermilionite, may earn themselves the Sunset moniker. This stone is what allows the Jade Chamber yeah, I was about to say, I'm assuming one of those Wonder Cores, meanwhile, are the central components of the mechanical structure of the Jade Chamber. Adepti sigils serve as a means of integrating the mechanical devices with Adepti art. Yep. They are as indispensable as the mechanical core itself. Although these three items are rare, I trust that with your connections and capabilities, procuring them Why will not be like a question a of if, to me? but of when. I take the saying, time is money, more seriously than most. Efficiency is everything. I will pay a generous price for the materials that you find. Why is he and like in he addition, the first three statement. people who collect all the materials will have the opportunity to ask me a question. Hey, yo. You may ask me anything, and I will give you an honest answer. <laughs> Can I marry you? I trust you? that this means of compensation will be to everyone's I'm... satisfaction. I These things won't be easy to get hold of, this game. but if it means a chance to get some inside information on Leo at Harbor's development plan for next year, she stands almost the same way I do. It's the deal of a lifetime. Information from Lady Ningguang is priceless. Whoever gets to it first takes the market. Okay, what if we don't? Want <laughs> what the a market? coincidence! I won't divulge too much, but I heard some murmurings about some plot strike just the other day. So excuse me, all, but um, I have some business to do. I'm assuming since it's gonna tell us where the hell to get everything. Oh, no. We better move quickly, or this opportunity will be snatched oh away God, from I us. Just dance in the background like la la la. Ningguang's rebuilding the Jade Chamber? This is a huge deal! Let's get involved! As expected. Hi. So you heard my announcement, did you? What do you think? Interested? Can I really ask you anything at all? Yes. Providing the question pertains to something I am knowledgeable about. Maybe I got her. Really? Ooh, then Paima will ask you about how to run a business! <laughs> There's a- Ooh, Lily! Then we'll never be short of Mora ever again! I'm the richest one here. <laughs> of course. When it comes but to- But how much information what? I share with you will depend on your performance. Understandable. I the construction of the Jade burn. Chamber requires a great deal of space. The abandoned mine outside the Golden House has been selected as the building site. Once you have collected the materials, please take them there. Also, I didn't even realize... I have other business to attend to now. Otherwise, I would gladly escort you to the site in person. When you do arrive, please seek out my secretary. Remember, this is a race against the clock. A <laughs> rare opportunity presents itself to you. Do not let somebody else snatch it from yes, your Yes, I hands. am. When it comes when it comes to the women and like for some men of this Ningle, game, absolutely I am. We're busy. Come on, we first we gotta get out of Eugene Terrace. Uh, huh? Look, it seems like there's something kind of fishy going Ma? on over there. Hello, ma'am. <gasps> you seem like an eminent and distinguished young lady to me. I can see that you're easily gonna win this procurement contest Lady Dingwang has set up. As it happens. 
We have some information about the materials that I really think might interest you. Come on, let's find somewhere a little more private, and we can get down to brass tacks. No, I don't need it. Ah, uh, don't be like I that. I think I think some of you are know what I'm hey, about to say. Come on, don't go! I didn't think I was gonna get her Why this don't soon. Just stand there after her. Fuck off. No, right? Yeah. I didn't pay attention to what this is called. They said they had some useful Go. information. Information, just what we need right now. Let's follow them and see what we can find. I don't even care about the lily. I don't care about the flower anymore. I'm going the wrong way. Stand corrected? Yeah. Huh. They're not here. Hmm. Let's keep looking. Huh. <laughs> well, will you look at that, ma'am? Nowhere left to run. Don't worry, we're not bad guys. You give us some Mora, we give you a little info. Everybody's a winner. Boss, I got a bad feeling about this. Look at her, the, the white hair, the, the energy she gives off. I, I'm telling you, there, there's something different about her. <laughs> so what? She's loaded. How are we ever going to repay those gambling debts if we just let money walk away from us, huh? I've already told you. I don't need your information. If you still can't grasp that, I'm happy to repeat it in a way that won't be so easy to forget. I mean, I'm in the forget. same boat, Eric. She's a, she's, <sighs> Come listen, on, listen, listen. You seem like an intelligent lady. Depending how this goes. This out to you. And also. It's not about whether you need the info uh, or not, Depending okay? how my college goes. It's about you taking out your money and handing it over and nobody getting hurt. I won't. Listen, she can and will kill you and I won't. No more excuses. <sighs> listen, you listen. Money? I saw she can you. kill you. Yeah, I saw you. And all that happened. to Leo Lee Pavilion, ordering a table full of food and only taking a few bites. Then she knew a kiosk, then Wan Min restaurant. Oh my god. Same story each time. You order all the signature dishes, take a few bites, then you're on your way again. How could you afford Does to this be add so to my urge that want to stab if you weren't from a rich family? And since you're so rich, What's the loss to you in giving us a little spare change, huh? She's not rich. <sighs> Master warned me not to lay a hand on anyone in Liyue Harbor. <sighs> but here we are. Hmm. Perhaps... Huh? Yes. yes! Yes! Let's call it fate. Boss, I'm telling you, something's not right. Kill him. What are you afraid of? We're just selling information. It's not illegal. If she lays a finger on us, all the better. We'll sue her for everything. Oh, you again. The Millilith. W w what are the Millilith doing here? Did you do this? Hmm? You ought to mind your own business. I swear. Silence. How dare you threaten innocent civilians. See? You're coming with us. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, don't, 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 don't be angry, sir. P p p please, let me explain. Young lady with the white, with the white, with... There's no the with white hair. <sighs> you alright? Shen He. Shen He? Shen He. My name. Hi. Oh, so your name's Shen He. Paimon's name is... Well, Paimon. And this is Paimon's travel buddy. Oh, I've heard about you two before. <sighs> Thank you for helping to defuse Oh, is this where I'm about situation. to get fucking rocked into a cliff? <sighs> I could have dealt with it myself, though. I Wait, is this thing smashing his head against the ground a handful of times is all it would have taken to get him to surrender. Wait. <laughs> you, you can't do that. I can't it's open that because that has the... I just have a back right there. Harbor. There are lots of 
against that kind of stuff, you know? Laws. <sighs> no. Apparently not. Really? So, how exactly have you... Is this the recent event? Well, I just accidentally hit my mic. That would be my stomach growling. Hmm, I haven't eaten enough. She's so honest. Wait, that's right! They said you went around all the restaurants ordering this and that and the other, but only took a small bite of each Is this dish. actually the new event? Then of course you're still hungry! So, anything in particular you're hungry for? Hmm, Chingson, Glaze Lily, Violet Grass. These are my usuals. Huh. Hmm, medicinal herbs? Explain. Mm. Anyway, Buka oh. Pharmacy's not far away. Damn, okay. Let's take Shenha there for a big medicinal meal. After all, you can't work on an empty stomach. Psst. Do you think Shenha might be a... No, it doesn't look like it, but at the same time, it does. Adaptus? Oh shit, I guess it is. Huh. Interesting. It seems like it's her first time in Leeway Harbor, and she doesn't seem to get how things work here. If she is an adeptus, that would explain everything. Chi-Chi? Oh, damn, Where it's not Chi-Chi. Where does she fit in? Damn it, it's not Chi-Chi. Are you here to buy some herbs? I do hope you brought your prescription. I forgot we always need fucking prescriptions. Chingsen, glaze lily, and violet grass, please. Half a pound of each. What kind of prescription is this? Sounds more like a lunch order. <laughs> oh, here you go. That's everything we have in stock. Hmm. Thank you. Those look pretty. She's really eating them! <laughs> Damn. Oh, my hunger has now abated. Thank you. How they taste? Rather awful. <laughs> I love her. Though they were not completely devoid of sweet fragrance. Again. After consuming again, a large quantity so of them, bitterness is all that remains. And now I want so her. How can you Actually, no, I've been I've been wanting her, but Shao was like food. more important. If Paimon had enough Mora, Paimon would go to the fanciest restaurant in town and order a whole table of food and eat it all in one go. Because I'm not sure whether I will remain here in the future. The food of the mortal realm is most delicious, but should I return to the mountains? Yearning for the food here shall only pose an obstacle to my continued spiritual development. Yeah, cause she... Sampling each dish in order to appreciate its taste is enough. Yeah, cause she... Return to the mountains! That proves it! She's not an adeptus. I knew she was an adeptus! Mm, enough about me. What are your plans from here? Oh, right! Paimon almost forgot! We came out to take part in the Rebuild the Jade Chamber! Competition! And... And now we're probably super behind because we've been it's held up for It's fine. So long. We have made care hmm, I see. Hmm, I heard something about the contest when I was passing by. We have we have main character <laughs> energy. Yep. You get to ask Ningguang any question you want if you win! Were you interested in the contest too, Shen, huh? Hmm. I came for the rebuilding of the Jade Chamber. But until this point, I had no intention of joining a contest. However, you have shown me your kindness, oh. and I would now like to lend you my assistance. Mm. Oh, don't worry. I ask for nothing in return. Oh. Wow! You really don't have to. Listen, but having listen, a deck this help out will make things a whole lot easier. Then let's not delay. I have a plan. Great! Paimon bets this is gonna be the <laughs> oh, the little nod. Mm. I am not sure whether or to what extent this plan can be classified as awesome. I do, however, believe it will be highly effective. 
We simply need to dispose of everyone who is currently <laughs> ahead of us. Then, we alone shall become the victors. Vito! That is not acceptable! <laughs> Murder! Not really? But I hear that competition is in essence about conflict and one-upmanship. And don't you have her? We want to win this competition fair and square, okay? <sighs> Sunset Vermilion Night, Wonder Course, and Adepti Sigils. Let's start at the top of the list and work down. <laughs> so, for Plastrite... I was wondering who I could hear arguing over there. Who? So, oh, God damn it! Hi. It's you. Bye, you. No, what are you uh, doing oh, no, but I will pull her. God damn it. Lady Ningguang wishes to purchase a large batch of wound dressing. When can I get him? Listen, store, I know some people so don't like him for like the slander and everything, but like, when can I get him? Personally. Huh? How can a Lady Ningguang need so much wound dressing all of a sudden? I'm not too sure. I did hear she's looking to rebuild the Jade Chamber. Maybe for its first aid on site? Has... I didn't ask, though. Far be it from me to pry into my customer's personal affairs. Oh, and she also borrowed Chi-Chi. Meaning Boo Boo Pharmacy is very short-handed right now. Sick. I don't suppose yeah. any of you I are mentioned it before, uh, how the, uh, the snake looks like Foster. Chance? No, no, we've got other stuff to do. Um, while you're here, though, you seem to know a lot. <laughs> Have you ever heard of something called Sunset Vermilionite? <laughs> ah, the variety of Plostrite used in the Jade Chamber, yes? There is some mention of it in the Seven Mountain Treatises. When activated, Sunset Vermilionite rises up all the way into the clouds. She's so fucking pretty. It's very rare indeed. As far as the records show, virtually all Sunset Vermilionite in existence has been mined and taken possession of. But the Feiyun Commerce Guild would know far more about this than I do. <laughs> okay then, let's go ask at the Feiyun Commerce Guild. <laughs> Thanks, Baiju! Let's go like shooting stars. You're quite welcome. Good I don't know why that song all. popped in my head. I don't know how I switched between two songs. Anything further you need from me. Just come to the Boo Boo Pharmacy. Oh, fuck. Oh, no. I hear the voice of fate speaking my name in humble supplication. Oh, no. Well, shit. I'm going there only for a second. <laughs> yep, because all the domains, uh, have been. Oh boy. Ad Astra Abyssal. Hmm. Yeah, I was like assuming forty. That's oh god, ill. Fuck. Hit my mic again. Oh god damn it, the boss need to fight for something that level up to start fucking skyrocketing. Your streamer is a fucking dumbass. Oh god, hello? Oh, no, I hate that. I- I- The fuck? Ah. <laughs> Streamer is overwhelmed. Does he have to- Maku! 
character's only level 40. Because I'm a dumbass! Oh. To think that the Geo Archon had signed a contract with the Cryo Archon. I wonder what the contents of their agreement were. Paimon doesn't care who you are. Making a deal with the Saritza is super dangerous. <laughs> Be that as it may. Since Morax is the god who understands the basis of contracts the best. <sighs> He's definitely given this some thought. Well, that's true. Morax himself called it the contract to end all contracts. I trust that we will witness the truth and its denouement play out. <laughs> Master Singcho, thank goodness you're finally back. Oh, hello. The fuck? Oh? Why do I detect an urgency in your voice? What is happening? The guild has had a whole string of strange orders in recently. Everyone's been completely caught off guard. Help, streamers. Your father gave me specific instructions to ask you to stay and help out if I happen to see you. I see. Have someone sort the orders by type for now. I'll deal with them myself shortly. Oh, how wonderful. Thank you, Master. With you on the job, I can breathe a sigh of relief. Hey, Xingqiu. Glad you're here. We want to ask you for some information. Oh, God. Traveler, Paimon, please wait a moment. Shu, I need to entertain some guests. Please continue with your work for the time being, and we'll discuss the matter of the guild's orders in more detail later on. Understood, Master Singchio. Then I will leave you in peace. I wasn't counting on finding you here today. What's going on? And how, pray tell, may I be of service? Xingqiu, have you ever heard of Sunset the She's Millionaire? She's so pretty. I love her eyes. Oh, I see. So you've entered Lady Ningguang's contest as well. Maybe. As well? Do you mean... Everyone is? The truth is, the Feiyun Commerce Guild is in possession of some Sunset Vermilionite, but only one piece. We are holding it on behalf of someone who has asked us to put it up for auction, and a lot of interested parties have already come to us inquiring about the price. At the end of the day, it all comes down to supply and demand. In this case, I'm guessing the final transaction price may be in excess of 500 million mora. 500 million?! Honestly, I would recommend that you don't bother bidding on this one. The price is greatly inflated, and it's just not worth it. But without any sunset, sometimes my parents like confuse me because I literally don't said they're probably not going to be there I because don't my school like is currently like Caesar? still technically closed down because everyone's doing online, so like no one is really who, like no one like on top of head is here. Hmm. Sea Gazer was once very close to Mountain Shaper, but if I am not mistaken, he has already passed away. Yes, precisely. I didn't know anyone else knew about him. According to God, records of drifting of clouds, Seagazer once built an abode to store his rarest and most exquisite treasures, among which was some sunset vermilionite. After Seagazer passed, the abode was abandoned, and its location was lost to time. Luckily, I came into possession of a stack of folk history books just recently, they make some oblique references to this lost abode, and after cross-referencing them against each other, I'm now fairly certain that it is situated in the Lisha area. That's great! Um, but is it really okay for us to just go and take his treasure? Wouldn't it be a little, you know, disrespectful with him being an adeptus? <laughs> you needn't worry. As far as I understand, Seagazer was very open-minded. Even while he was alive, he wouldn't have let something like this bother him. Open-minded? I have not heard of Seagazer being described in this way before. May I ask where you read that? Just a rumor I heard out in the mountains. <sighs> All right then, let's go. Hmm... There's something about this young lady that reminds me of a good friend of mine. Oh, I almost forgot. 
Adepti abodes tend to have very ingenious designs, especially when it comes to their defense mechanisms. Plus, it's likely to be crawling with monsters after being abandoned for so long. So please, be very careful. Okay, we will be. Thanks, Xingqiu. created another universe and founded paradise for I, Fischl, and the princess and de for er You have two seconds <laughs>
I do worry about <sighs> the well-being of my retinue during my impromptu absence. I'm sure the... I created another universe and founded Paradise, for I, Fischl, and the Princess and... I created another universe and founded Paradise. Alright, I got it. I know you create a whole other universe. Hi, I'm back. Ignore how literally my stream crashed while I was on the phone call. <laughs> God, my parents don't understand what the concept of no and really do not like, <laughs> finish a goddamn sentence, but hi, I'm back. Let's see. Shincho said it should be around here, but Paimon doesn't see anything. Hi. Ow. Hmm. This place was hidden using a special Adepti art. But now that I have removed it, we can inspect the area more closely. Huh, I wonder why. Wow, that's amazing! Yep, let's take another look around! Hey, look! Is that a new Celia over there? Hello. Hi, friends. I hit my mic again. I'm so sorry. Where are you going, friend? Huh? <laughs> a Sealy got to here and then disappeared. Should we go over and take a look? Ah, oh, son of a bitch. Oh god, it's a domain that I'm not high enough level for. <sighs> what, what's the recommended? 49. F oh shit! <laughs> so recommended is Pyro and Crypto. Pyro. Oh my god, I can't fucking read. Okay. And I don't even think I can like level anyone up without insane shit. Yeah, because the horns are from things that I don't want to fight. I wonder when I'll be as tall as my big sister. Yeah, it's just basically I'm literally f just fighting a creature. I have to fight that again? Fuck. Ew. Ren, you want to get into a party later? Nice. Because I don't want to- I don't want to try it right now because I will fucking scream. I actually like seeing that they can see like what they're associated with. I did not notice that. Nice. Okay. I don't want to check it out just yet because I've fucking screamed during some of these. But I also don't want to end the stream because I- yeah, I was about to be like... I have four out of eight of them. Hey, it's a beta. Yeah, and I need- I need one more key. Complete the crane. Okay, I have to do it. Okay. I'm gonna end stream here. Uh, just because I really don't want to- again, I don't like doing domains on stream because I hate how silent I go. Um, but if you see me playing, hi. Um, don't question it. So... There's really no one, like, small playing. Um, but Foolish is currently playing Stardew. And I'm gonna very quickly bully run into doing this with me. So we're gonna raid Foolish. Uh, because he's playing Stardew. And, uh, Ren, you better fucking get on. Yeah, I will... I will try to stream tomorrow. I don't know. My classes are gonna be very exhausting. Uh, but, yeah.
拜拜。